pandemic came, got to a point that China had to claim, they came to their rescue. We shouldn't pretend that we needed foreign support now. Let nobody deceive us, Mr. President. A lot of billions of Naira have been voted for, for security uh, uh, services. Nothing is coming out of it. We wouldn't wait until our nation gets bombed. Let us shout and cover foreign, uh, foreign support. I am a PAPC man and I've been supporting my party. But the president should get to know that it has gone to a point that we who are supporters, who are members of the APC, we can no longer keep quiet. The president was rise to the occasion. You are say we are in some You will not see the truth and you are afraid to say it because you will die. We must open, Mr. President. The nation is on fire. The president was rise to the occasion. It costs us nothing to get foreign, foreign support. We must rise to the occasion. We must bring in people to save this country. Or else we'll be consumed. Every one of us will have a chapter for history. Whenever the history of this period will be, will be written, whatever is our position, we have a chapter. We cannot keep quiet any longer. It has gotten to a point that we cannot sleep with our two eyes closed. We are not free. Our children are not free. The president must rise to the occasion. There's no nation that is so powerful that it doesn't need support of other nations. Individual could not, cannot say you will leave the world without any other person with you. So we must rise. The situation is, we have, our security system has collapsed. It has failed. And because it has failed, we need to look for foreign support. It costs Nigeria nothing. Forget the ego, ego. forget the superiority of Nigeria in African nations. Today, we are facing serious problems. If our nation is to survive this period, I'm, I'm not in doubt that the security architecture we have today cannot cope with what we are facing. Every part of this country is threatened. From the north to the south, nobody is safe. Nobody can travel 50 kilometers in our nation. I feel like shedding tears for a country that we grew up. Where nobody harass you when you travel from Lagos to Maduguri. I don't need in time fast. Today I cannot travel from here to Kaduna to Niger State where I was born. The president must know that this is a bad time for our nation. We must look for foreign support to save this nation. This is my position, Mr. President. We must rise to it. They are killing people in the east, in the west, in the south, in the north. We should shut down the National Assembly. Let's shut down if we cannot save this country. We stay in our homes. Our country is bleeding. People are in poverty. There's no food. People are hungry. Insecurity is threatening us. We cannot pretend. It's better we are not here. Then the next thing that your people are dying. Every day Nigerians are dying. We must rise on the occasion. I saw me, Mr. President. 